now we are going to do the problems regarding this is where the numerical problems are coming up guys please have a close look how i am going to do the problem i will be giving you step by step section itself and will i will take it in a slow pace so we'll start with a very very basic level 1 of conversion of a you know a uh, unit from one unit to another unit which you know when you looking at it will be itself you will understand this what type of question blunder question i am giving but to introduce a system called unity bracket method i am using it okay so see the first question is conversion of 230 cm into meter which you can understand by looking at itself it will be 2.3 meter but i want to introduce what method unity bracket method this is what i want to introduce this is very easy in the case of simple question when it comes in top for question then this method is very very useful <clears throat> now guys first time if you are attempting it or of course you are attempting it of course it will take time it's okay take your time understand it then we we'll do a lot of question then the speed will come by itself right now what for unity bracket method is unity right so something related to one right so you have just have to multiply a term with one right that means i will just multiply 230 cm with one so you would have why i am multiplying with one when you multiply a term with one nothing much change happens right anything multiplied with one is that same term so when i multiply 230 cm with one it will be 230 cm itself that is the first point guys i have not reached it okay now that one plays a very very important role here now look son guys see what is 100 cm in terms of meter that you should know okay 100 cm is 1 meter this much you know so what happens if i bring 100 cm hold below to 1 meter that is what is 1 meter by 100 cm what it is 1 meter by 100 cm this comes to the denominator so what will be the lhs be 1 right similarly what is 100 cm by 1 meter guys that is also 1 1 meter comes here right you have two terms of 1 this much clear just listen to the steps which i am doing guys then we'll go on now what i told you have to just multiply 230 i am going to back to the question guys i am going to multiply 230 cm with 1 so that there is no change in the value now this one can be either this right i want is this value one is also having this value so what i am going to do let's say i'm going to put this value here 230 cm into 1 is also equal to 1 meter divided by 100 cm let's make it as a division here right right can i cut something yes cm cm then 0 0 23 by 10 is 2.3 something else is there right m and into 1 is there right into 1 meter One thing into one is same, so it is two point three meter, right? You got the answer. This is a process, guys. Understand it, right? Now you would ask, one is equal to one meter by hundred centimeter. I put that value. Why can't I put this value here? One is also equal to hundred centimeter by one meter, so I'll put that also. See. Now let's say two thirty centimeter into one, right? In place of one, I'm going to write to the centimeter into one. Is I'm going to write it as hundred centimeter divided by one meter, right? What happens? Two thirty into hundred centimeter square, right? Centimeter into centimeter, centimeter square divided by one meter. That means meter. what type of conversion it is you are getting the unit as what centimeter squared by meter right what is your requirement you are asked the answer should be in terms of meter not in centimeter squared by meter 
in terms of meter only there should not be any terms in centimeter that's why i'm not opting this value of 1 i opted the value this one clear or there is a shortcut guys when you multiply with 1 the term should be having the denominator as a unit you want to cut off you want to cut off centimeter right so take the value where centimeter is in below section clear i hope this much is clear first time when you are hearing it will be very difficult guys please pause the video re-listen to understand the logic this you could have done with one step in fractional second itself but i wanted to introduce which method unity bracket method right let's move on to this next question for the level one itself second question guys you are asked to convert 135 seconds to minutes this also you can do with naked eyes so, uh, in, uh, in fraction of seconds so again what we have to do the first step is i have to multiply 135 second with one right now this one i have to move on right so one i want in terms of minute 10 second so one minute tell me how many second it is 60 second this much is clear right so one can be written as 60 second by one minute right or i can write it as one is equal to one minute by 60 seconds so both are correct right i can write both the values now i told you i want to cut off second right i want to cut off second so second is in the numerator section right so if i multiply one with this term so second comes in the numerator so it becomes second in the second second square so should i take this term no i will take this term why when i multiply here one in place in place of one i would write one minute by 60 second right so second second can cancel out i will do it guys see 135 second into one minute by 60 second this way i put it right now second second cancel out so 135 by 60 there is only minute right right yeah you will get a value of around 2.25 minute this division please do it guys i hope this much is clear right so let's we'll see this one also why i am not multiplying with 60 seconds that we'll be doing here see 135 into i'm putting this value in place of 1 60 second by 1 minute what type of answer you're going to get so this is in seconds right so this will be second squared by minute i don't want second in my answer i only require minute so second has to be cancelled out so second has to be in denominator and minute has to be in numerator clear right now let's do this much is clear right now um, then another thing then another, let's do another third question right suppose pound is in written in lb guys that is you are given eight pound is asked to be converted into kilogram and i'm giving you one kilogram is equal to 2.2 pound lb that is a uh, you know symbol for pound how would you convert again start with unity i have to multiply lb with one this much clear now you have the criteria given criteria that is one kilogram is equal to 2.2 lb so one can be written as i require lb in denominator guys then only lb goes off right so one will be equal to one kilogram divided by 2.2 lb right now in place of one i am going to write this value that is 8 lb into 1 kilogram denominator 2.2 lb now can i cancel out lb yes so there is 8 divided by 2.2 kilogram this is around 3.63 kilogram please do the calculation guys you guys are big guys you guys can do at least this one right i hope this much level one problems is very easy guys yes now we'll move on to the level 2 that is which is a, a neat JE level not that much risky 
that need je level will do it later on guys now let's move on that is level 2 basic section level 2 is basic then we'll go on to the higher level now listen to the question it is 20 meters sec per second we are asked to convert it into kilometer per minute by this method i am asking how to do it because here there is not one unit actually there are two units right that is meter this is kilometer second into minute right so what you have to do you have to consider each guys right see 20 meter per second can be written as 20 meter by one second can't i write it yes so i want to convert meter into kilometer and second into minute so I, here i am going to write here right so what is thousand meter is equal to one kilometer i want to remove meter from here so that means denominator should be meter so that means this has to come off so one is equal to one kilometer divided by thousand meter right right similarly minute and second 60 second is equal to one minute right second i want to go off so when i multiply it with one second should be in denominator so one second is equal to one by 60 minute right by second like this clear now i have two terms for one so one second la one so one is having two terms so see so i'm going to multiply one in numerator one in denominator does it make any change in the entire value no now do it like this 20 meter into one in place of one i'm going to write it as one kilometer by thousand meter whole divided by one second here and do in place of one i'm going to write one minute by 60 second easy peasy yes right now numerator section guys 20 meter this meter meter cuts off right so we not write meter this second this second cuts off yes so in numerator there is 20 kilometer by 1000 here guys right denominator right in numerator section itself 1 kilometer by 1000 here there will be 1 minute by 60 only 60 goes up so it becomes 60 divided by 1 minute i hope this much is clear guys see it is 1 by 60 20 by 1000 so 20 by 1000 into 60 by 1 denominator fraction it is reversed when multiplied that is how the division is done i hope this and all things you remember from your basic classes right so now this is only calculation because the unit now has only kilometer per minute so this is how much how much it will be the will be 20 into 60 divided by 1000 you will get it as i'm writing here guys 6 by 5 kilometer per minute that is your answer right how did you come at a 6 by 5 zero, 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 zero. so 12 by 10 that is 6 by 5 kilometer per minute i hope this much is clear guys it is very easy to understand this much portion i'm going to refresh the conversion so listen what is the first step for converting uh, using unity bracket method you have to multiply any unit conversion with one now then listen or look for what conversion has to be done see let's move on to the formula or a problem itself you want to convert seconds to minute so you have to find the relationship between what and what second and minute and then find the term one in terms of second and minute so one minute is equal to 60 seconds means one can be equal to 60 second by minute one minute right then just you know you have to replace one with this value right you replace the value now i hope this much is clear right listen guys whenever you are having a term like this see seconds i have to multiply with one's term 
there are two terms can come for one right it can be either second by minute or minute by second if it had been second by minute when i multiply it will be second squared which is not required you remove you want to remove what happens when you multiply this term you are increasing the amount of term in the terms of seconds right it becomes second squared which you don't require right so you multiply with minute by second so that second second cancels out i'm taking the example guys so that you guys can understand right you have to just practice guys i hope uh, you are having a numerical question in your ncrt book um, uh, in your exercise i will ask you guys to do it as a homework i will put it as a homework in your uh, assignment section right so please do this much section is very easy if you understood this method is known as unitary bracket method you might not have understood it for the first try i would request you guys to pause the video listen it again and again and then repeat the same examples write it in your paper and try to do it by yourself and see whether you are getting the same answer as i have got clear right i'm not elaborating i have not taken that much of topic today guys it is a very easy topic you can finish it off very easily